How's it going guys and welcome to my new series on YouTube. So ever since I was a young kid, I always seemed to follow Jean-Luigi Buffon. He was one of my favorite players in football. So I thought, why not this year do a series around him? It's something different, so I thought I'd give it a go. So we're going to use this 89 rated squad builder challenge card and we're basically going to fill him around a bronze team. And the way we do it is every time we score a goal, we are able to upgrade a player by uh, judging by the budget we are given. But there's one twist to this series. We are not starting from Division 10. We are starting from Division 1, which is why it's going to be such a challenge first up. Um, so if you do enjoy this concept, please leave a like, rating, and subscribe if you're new around here. And without further ado, let's get into the rules. So as we look at the rules here of our new series, we can see that every time we score a goal, we are able to add a player depending on the budget we are given. So if we only score one goal, we have a budget of 300 coins and 1,000 coins. Two goals is 1,000 coins to 2,000. Three, three goals is 2,000 and 5,000 and goes on until 50k plus. The extra rules here are if we get a hat trick, clean sheet or rage quit, we get a two rare gold player pack, which is untradeable. Um, if we win the title of the division, we are able to unlock any player um, on the market, whether it be a legend or a inform or something like that. It can be completely out of our budget, but we are allowed to go for it. If we hold our division, we are allowed to buy one random player from the transfer list. And what we do is we just search up any um on the transfer market, roll the dice, go to that page, whether it's page four, roll the dice again, if it's number two, we buy that second player. And it can be anything from a legend to an inform or even a 45 rated bronze. Uh, relegation, we do lose our player to our discretion, um, just because like we don't really want to be losing top players in Division 1. Um, and that sort of tops it. So let's head to the team. So as you can see guys here, here is the team we're going to use at the start. So obviously we've got the 89 rated Juan Luigi Buffon, 89 diving, 88 reflexes, 90 handling and 92 positioning. He is an absolute boss being 6 foot 4 as well. It looks an insane card. In the defense, we're running a 4-1-2-1-2 by the way because it is my favorite formation in the game. Um, we've got Jedi and Calabrese, both decently paced um, bronzes. Uh, Piccarini and Ming Mignanelli in the fullback positions. I'm very, I apologize for butchering these names, guys. Uh, Altabelli is our CDM with Daola and Dalolio as our center mids. And then Cam, we've got Tremolada. Our two strikers, we've got my pack pulled foot champions bronze, Masucci. And Di Girolamo are our two strikers. Now down here, there are four empty sub spots remaining. And that's because we're going to open two, two red gold player packs, which are untradeable, to give us a sort of a boost as super subs. Because these guys literally have about 30 stamina and we'll need to bring on super subs. So hopefully we can get something that can either improve our team or even help us in the super subs. Uh, these three silvers here are only just to boost the rating up. They're not going to be used at all in our in our run. Um, so without further ado, let's go into the packs. So as you can see here, guys, we have two two rare gold player packs, um, which are both untradeable, just to give us a couple of super subs that we can use in Division One. And in our first pack, we get an amazing player. We in fact get an inform Steven and Zonzi. We are. I am so happy that we got this card. I mean, he's an insane box-to-box -box midfielder or even a CDM and will definitely fit in our team later on. We also got Christian Teo, which I cannot complain with because he'll be an insane striker up front with, with that 92 pace. In the second one, we get an even better one. We get Mustafi, which is an okay defender. I mean, he'll fit in as a super sub later on, but we also get Benashi. And of course, since he's at Juventus now, he gets a strong link with uh, Buffon, which means that he'll fit into our team straight away. So here are the four players that we received from the packs, and what we're going to do straight away is we're going to put Benashia into the team to replace Calabrese, and that's because Jedi has got decent pace and already really good physical, whereas Calabrese only has 66 physical, so it'd be best if he left out of the team. 
after half time, we are allowed to bring on subs. We're not allowed to bring on subs before half time. And what we're going to do is bring on Nzonzi into the CDM role, bring Mustafi on, and Teo up at front. So that really covers the brand new team. Let's get into the gameplay. So into our first match we go, he's got the purple Sterling and inform Benita, uh, gold red Adam Lalana, inform and Zonzi and Dele Ali and the Premier League team to go with it. Uh, it's, he must be very good, obviously, due to the fact he has got that gold Lalana, meaning he has got gold or higher in foot champs monthly. Um, so into the first highlight, Ben has got the ball. He passes it over to Sterling to Lalana with a brilliant five-star weak foot finish into the bottom left corner. It's a good goal and was down 1-0 into seven minutes. 11 minutes in, Dal Olio gives the ball over to Del Guerramado, who has a pretty poor shot, but it shows that we do have potential. Now, good tiki-taki passing to Ben Yedda and a lovely save from Buffon. He is an absolute beast. Uh, 57 minutes in through half time, a lovely ball into Ben Yedda and a nice cool finish with his five-star weak foot. Um, 2 0 down, not looking good for us. Then we have a lovely run from the newly subbed on Christian Teo with his 92 pace and sweats it across to Masucci, who tucks it in nicely. 2 1, we're still into a shot and just a cheeky dab just to get him a bit fired up. Into the 80th minute now, Sterling with an absolute banger at the top right corner and shushing me. Just to prove a point here. Now into the 90th minute. As you can see, I was trying to aim it to Buffon, but Christian Taylor gets a late AG header on, and it's 3-2, and it finishes off there. So as you saw in that last match, we won by two goals, which gives us a budget between 1,000 coins and 2,000 coins. Now, I was thinking, I want to keep Nzonzi in the series for a very long time. So why not put him into the starting lineup and then get some, a perfect link to him. And that person is Wissam Ben Yedda. And he is an absolute insane striker, guys. Five-star weak foot, four-star skills. High, high work rate is a bit, um, isn't that great on a striker. And five foot seven, but he just finishes all his chances, guys. And he is definitely going to be an amazing um, striker for us. So that covers the first part of the first game. Let's get into the second one. So into our second and final match today, he has got a 3-4-2-1 formation with the likes of SBC, Insigne, Adair, Kondreva, Perisic, Jalmaria, Asamo and Biglia, uh, Rodriguez, Maximovic, Manolas and Perrin, an absolute cheap team but extremely OP. I get really nervous when coming up against these guys. But into the ninth minute here, we've got a lovely run into Tremolado, who tucks in beautifully into that bottom right corner, and it's 1-0 up even before 10 minutes. Uh, into the 37th minute now, and Zondi with a lovely little shot there, but gets blocked and then picks it up and again into that bottom corner, and we're 2-0 up before half time. It's looking really good for us. Into the 74th minute here, a lovely run from Masucci, who just sort of passes it back to Nzonzi, and he's got two for the net. And it finishes 3 0. And it's an outstanding result from our team. So, since we won with a clean sheet, we were rewarded with a two red gold player pack. So, let's open up this pack. It is not a walkout. Is it a big flare? Yes, it is. Who is it? It is Raphael Varane. We will happily take that because he is French. Um, the, he is an insane card, guys. Well deserved. And we also get Memphis Depay, who we we'll probably will use as a super sub, but we are definitely happy with that Raphael. So as we won that by three goals, we have a budget of 2 to 5k. We are absolutely amazed that we won this game, considering it's basically a bronze team. Um, so I was thinking maybe try someone to link up Ben Yedda and the other striker. So we are going to go with the, not a special striker, we are going with the newly transferred Simon Zaza. Just because he is Italian and from the La Liga, he can link up with both Benita and Zaza, which means that he gets full chem. Later on, I think, in the next in a future episode, we are going to focus on the right back. We're planning on trying to get maybe Danny Alves or even Conco, um, just to get Steven and Zonzi on full chem, but he has just been outstanding for us anyway. Um, so that wraps up the upgrades and this episode. So if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, rating, and subscribe if you're new around here. And without further ado, I will see you later.